The 19th century was a great era for landscape painting in the United States. Thomas Cole, seen here in a photograph by Matthew Brady, was the first great landscape painter of 19th century America. He was born in England, but painted some of the most influential depictions of the American landscape. Cole's most famous painting, one that he called View from Mount Holyoke, Northampton, Massachusetts, after a thunderstorm, is known to everyone today as simply the oxbow. An oxbow is a wide meander in a river created by increased erosion on one bank and deposition on the other. In the foreground is a painter, perhaps Cole himself, giving viewers the illusion that we are witnessing nature in the wild. But in fact, like all of Cole's landscapes, the oxbow was painted in his studio from a pencil sketch. When he painted the oxbow, Cole was not simply creating a beautiful work of art, although it is indeed supremely beautiful, he was commenting on the gradual destruction of the American wilderness. Cole's painting is a composition of two contrasting halves. To the left is a wild forest engulfed by dark storm clouds. A blasted tree hints at death. To the right, all is calm and bathed in sunlight. The tranquil river winds its way amid carefully cultivated fields and tiny plumes of smoke from the chimneys of settlers' cabins rise into the air. We are witnessing in one painting the process of clearing the wilderness that took Americans centuries to complete. For Cole, a devout Christian, this process seems to have religious significance. On the slopes of the distant mountain are three Hebrew letters written upside down. Nobody noticed these letters in the painting for a hundred years. They spell out the Hebrew word for the Almighty.